Well, guess what? Um, so we got some special guests here today because you remember that little contest you put in, thank a teacher? Uh, we won. Woo! We had hundreds of submissions from all over, and we only picked one winner from high school, one winner from middle, and one winner from elementary school. And Jocelyn, you are the winner from the middle school. We're so happy. Thank you. special guest with us today because someone in this room is being honored so I'm gonna let one of our guests kind of take over and explain what's going on we held an art contest in January for students all across the Commonwealth to submit artwork for note cards that are gonna go to teachers during teacher appreciation week in May Thousands of note cards will be sent with this winner's artwork on the very front. And I'm here today to announce the winner. Do you guys want to know who won? No, you don't mind. We'll let you get back to practice. No big deal. All right. Congratulations to Giello. Yay! You know that the student that did the best artwork that we selected around the Commonwealth as the best thing. Her name is Nitha Nithan. Nitha! And this is the winning picture. This is Nitha's work. You remember doing this, Nitha? Yeah. It is amazing. I drew this um, because there's a lot of teachers around the world that helps students become smart and kind. So I drew this one. She sees what teachers do and she sees how they affect other students. And um, I don't know that I would have seen that in some of the assignments that I gave her, but I really liked being able to see it on that because that that's what she thinks. And that means a lot to me and I know it means a lot to a lot of other teachers. I heard that the prize would be putting the artwork on thousands of note cards to be delivered to teachers and so I really wanted my dad to be on that note card because I really wanted people to recognize him and recognize that name. Hey, Mr. Capate, that was my high school teacher. Having some extra money for supplies for our students and our teachers to continue their passion and their craft is huge and it allows us to keep money in our budget so that we can pay our teachers what they're worth by adding a little bit extra into that supply account so they can get whatever they need to ensure that our students are successful. What we do is we raise money for K-12 public schools, but we want to go a step beyond that. We want to really make a personal connection with the teachers and students that make our schools run every day. Thank you, Virginia Lottery!